In most municipalities, it's the clash of the titans, if there's any contest at all. But in the sleepy Karoo community of Prince Albert, major parties are up against a tiny independent in the upcoming elections. The Kodua Gemeenskaps Partij, only formed months before the previous elections, garnered more than 50% of the votes in 2011. It says a smaller party is best suited to govern in a small town. We worked with the people on ground level. It's not about we, are, we was elected in 2011 and wait until 2015 to going back to the people. We worked with the people and went back to the people since 2011, each and every year. The Good Governance Africa Index has ranked Prince Albert as one of the top 20 best municipalities in the country. But the problems dogging so many South African towns and cities exist here too. In so long as what I can know, what I can play, I can never get work. I can never make it work. I have to do the job for us. I don't know how they are going to do the same thing, but here in Prince Albert, I think it's going to be very good. And they do it very good for us in the week. I was very clear to see it all over. But the DA and the ANC will not see the governance go uncontested. We're going to uh, uh, look into the infrastructure so that we can create a conducive environment for, uh, for the investors to come into Prince Albert so that there can be more opportunities for the people of Prince Albert so that they can uh, get opportunities, get more work opportunities. Our people uh, want work opportunities and the infrastructure in, in this place is not good. The KGP, who worked in coalition with the ANC following the 2011 elections, is planning to go it alone this time round.